Welcome Aries. Let's see what's going on for you guys. Um, this is the last quarter of the year 2020. Do you want? Um, and um we have the month October, November, and December. We're going to be looking at them month by month. I want to say thank you if this is your first time. Thank you for being here. Let's see what's coming up. For you Aries who wants the on demand, you can pick them up on my website or you can join and become a member. Mm -mm. Five of Swords. Some sort of information came out about uh um and I see the eight of cups, some sort of a emotional ending for you, Aries. And we see the Nine of Swords. A Gemini is going to be overcoming a situation. So some of you are dealing with, um, yeah, some sort of a mystical thing. Uh, yeah, you Aries could be uh, working through mystic, could be getting dreams through the mystical time. Um, 31st of October began the mystical time. Uh, check out the channel for a reading with some sort of an information. Now, what I'm seeing is that if you are an Aries that work with witchcraft, that sort of a thing, um, the mystical sense, they're going to be recognizing that some of you Aries had co-created and do something. Some of you Aries um, are going to be trying witchcraft to block uh, some sort of... Uh, um prison time i see some of you aries yes so i see um some of you using witchcraft to get some sort of a relationship or um your partner used witchcraft to um get you connected okay aries so be aware i see that some of you aries is dealing with a pisces woman well the pisces woman is i see this is a new lover that is coming in your life and I see the Pisces woman is offering you love, okay? Now, the Pisces woman wants some sort of a new start with you, Aries. Are you ready to give the Pisces woman this new start? I see they're finding out a whole lot of information in another country. Um, if you're from another country, Aries and uh, a whole lot of information about a Gemini who created some sort of a deceptiveness. They're not recognizing and seeing the truth of what a Gemini did. Now, a Gemini could be a police. A Gemini can be a lawyer. Whoever this Gemini, whoever this person is. So I see um, a Gemini woman in another country could be getting um, in some problems because they found out that this Gemini woman could have accessed some sort of a data and information. They could recognize that um, some of you Aries use a Gemini woman to um, uh, to do some sort of a form of witchcraft. They could be listening to you on your telephone and that sort of a thing. And um, <clears throat> it is a situation where um, you wanted to get out of some sort of a prison sentence. Okay. I see a new love is coming in. Someone from another country, a Gemini. Be aware of this person. Okay. Whoever this Gemini is from another country, you beware because it's not whoever this Gemini is does not carry positive energy. So be aware of this. A lot of you Aries, um, some sort of a new love is coming in. This new love is, uh, um, you know, they're giving you some sort of and, and uh, communicating some things. But I would say Aries, you know, be aware. Um, and a Gemini, whatever the situation is, I see a Gemini in another country, something about a Gemini in another country that is happening. 
and it's as if some of you Aries is thinking about a Gemini in another country. It's as if you miss this person, whatever is happening and transpiring, you're co-creating and communicating with a Gemini in another country. Oh, yes. So be aware of this. In the month of uh, um, November, here is this Gemini coming up. It's a Gemini woman. You got to be aware who is this Gemini woman, okay? And I see some sort of a growth is going to be coming up. So this Gemini woman could be offering you something. This Gemini woman from another country could be a lawyer, could be someone who is going to be offering you something. Um, why? Okay. Why? And be aware of this person because I don't know what it is. Um, yes, it's... This woman is offering you love. Who is this Gemini from another country that is offering you love? There, you know, could be helping you out, releasing yourself out of some sort of an emotional situation. And um, I see this person is uh, emotionally bonded and connected to you and want to grow and connect more with you. Is it your mom? Could be your mom that a lot of you could be someone who you grew up with but i see some sort of a communication and uh, this person is has is showing you a lot of love okay and i see you're going to be growing closer to this person then we see um some sort of an offer that um this woman is like this woman is trying to pull you closer to them because they want something okay it could be a job offer that this person is offering you some sort of a, a job. It could be another person from another place. So, yes. So, I see you're going to be, you know, receiving some sort of a new job offer. Um, some of you. Um, it could be that some of you um, decide to just walk away from a situation because it's not serving you. Could be a job. You're recognizing, no, I don't want this position. Okay. Queen of Pentacles is here in the month of November. What is happening? What is transpiring? Is this your mother? Is this your mother? Okay. Some sort of a data and information about this person. Uh, the fox. Okay. Fox. And um, it's like someone is profiting. Who is this Queen of Pentacles? Yes, this Queen of Pentacles is loaded. And when I say loaded, it's really loaded. The Queen of Pentacles have money. Okay. Um, and the Queen of Pentacles, yes, the Queen of Pentacles this is in another uh, country. And they is very wealthy. A very wealthy person. It's very positive. The Queen of Pentacles is going to be helping some of you Aries. Um um to start a business um this person is really really going to be working together with some of you aries to start a business uh, whoever this queen of pentacles is so uh, is someone who is very good at uh, um you know their business uh, they are going to be um opening up doors for you and i see this is going to be coming up in november okay so this is a really really positive um uh, Aries and especially for young Aries that uh, walk away from a job young Aries that uh, recognize that a job position wasn't bringing you what you wanted <clears throat> I see that you're going to be walking away a lot of you Aries was dealing with a Leo person I see um this Leo person was trying to get some sort of a new start it's not going to be happening um you Leo's tried to use witchcraft to get this uh, Leo person some sort of a new offer it's not going to be uh, um um here um the two of uh, ones this new offer that you Aries was trying to get for a younger person is not going to be working out uh, as you had taught okay so um whatever that was transpiring um it is Mars in Capric Mars in uh, um Aries okay so it's as if whatever is happening whoever this Leo is I see emotions around this Leo in the month of October and you're going to be trying 
to give a, a, this Leo another new storage again. But I see um, a Aquarian, Gemini or Libra person is to say no. Um, so whatever is transpiring could be your child. It could be the child mother. You want the child's mother to come and spend Christmas with you. And, uh, um, you know, there is some sort of a, a agreement about this self word. Self-worth, a lot of you Aries need to find self-worth. I see a young um a young Pisces Cancer Scorpion person or a young Aquarian Gemini or a Libra person is going to be saying, um, you know, Aries, uh, uh, you know, go work for yourself. You know, um, you are really good at what you do. And this is a good friend. So young Aries, a good friend, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person is going to be saying to you, look at you, you have self-worth, okay? You can make a whole lot of money, okay? And um, whatever it is, they're going to be helping you to open up new doors for yourself and help you to make money for yourself, okay? So is that if you were looking for a job and trying to stumble, looking for a job and that sort of a thing, you're going to be recognizing that you're going to be getting some help. So we have the energy of uh, seven of wands. A lot of you Aries are going to be standing your ground in the month of December, okay? And whatever it is, is that you are standing your ground and showing up, uh, and protecting your kids, especially you Aries women, um, whatever that was happening and transpiring, you're going to be standing your ground, showing up for yourself. You're ending some sort of a disorganized situation um, where your kid was uh, um, treated unfairly and you ladies are going to be protecting your kid and standing your ground to protect your kid. Now, we see the energy of the Eight of Pentacles. So you're ending the year on a very positive note, um, an extremely, extremely positive note. This Eight of Pentacles is good, but I see some of you are sick. Or some of you, if your uh, parents is a Virgo, um, they could be sick. You could be getting some sort of a news at the end of the a month from a friend that's saying that your parents, one of your parents are sick. They're going to be recognizing a really disturbing situation that a, a Pisces and a Virgo created. And um, it could be a situation against you, whatever that was transparent and happening, a situation against you that a Virgo have created to get to, along with a Pisces. So, uh, some of you, your elders, if you're, one of your parents is Virgo or one of your parents is Pisces, I see you're going to be finding out that they're not well in the month of December. So um, it is a clear cut reading. I see that um, a lot of you, some sort of a regrets uh, is like you Aries, you are trying to get your lover um, to travel someplace, but it's as if the mother said to this younger child, it could be, yes, your child. So some of you are in a relationship with a uh, um, Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person, and um, you have a child with this person, and you are trying to get your child to come and spend Christmas, and the mother says no. So if you have um, a child with an Aquarian person, um, the mother is going to say no to you, because um, I see you are trying to get this person um, to come and spend Christmas with you. I see that they recognize that a Gemini person created a huge theft and took a whole lot of money from a Taurus, Virgo, a Capricorn person on the false pretend. I see um, a Sagittarian person recognize what a Gemini person have done and how this Gemini person have stolen and uh, profit from you for a very long time. Some of you Aries, man, your lover could be going to jail, okay? Mm-hmm. Are uh, you Aries, man, you could be going to jail because you have done something. It's like you Aries, man, try to get someone, um, something, okay? Your lover, they're going to be, some of you are going to find out that your lover has been cheating. And some of you are going to be finding out that your lover could have used some sort of a, a mysticism to get you in some sort of a relationship. This secret is going to be coming out in December 
and you're going to be cutting it down because I see someone is going to be saying, hey, don't you recognize that this person use um, love magic to get you in some sort of a relationship and you are going to be shutting it down. Someone at the workplace, a Pisces or a Virgo at the workplace is not well. And you could be getting their position, okay? I see a whole lot of emotions for a scorpion man. Some of you are in a relationship with a scorpion man, a whole lot of emotional. And the scorpion person, parents and them, is very, very emotional. Because I see the scorpion person recognize that an Aquarian Gemini or Libra have took them down a whole lot of money. Whether um, a Pisces, this can be a Pisces lover. Some of you have a Pisces lover, but you're seeing also a Leo person. So you could be married. And this person is very emotional. I see this person wanted some sort of a new start, but it's not going to be happening. So it could be that some of you are in a relationship with a Leo and you were trying to get some sort of a job for them, but it's not going to be happening. A lot of you Aries are going to be getting a job. Um, a lot of you Aries um, that was kind of, you know, going back and forth, what it is you want, what it is you want. I see that you will be resolved. A resolution is coming in. Okay. Um, <clears throat> uh, someone wanted some sort of an invitation. And <clears throat> whoever an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person is, 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 uh, I see an end is coming up for this woman. And, uh, um, there is a Leah woman. Uh, if you Aries was connected to a Leah woman or your mother was a Leah or so, I see an end um, for some sort of... So if you men were having some sort of a problem with your wife and that sort of a thing, I see an end coming up for you in December. An end to the secrets of a Pisces. Whoever this Pisces is, you Aries, you could have... A Pisces child or a, a, um, whoever the Pisces is had a lot of secrets. Secrets about money and an end is coming in. So we see a really positive um, uh, situation in the month of October that is going to be coming up for a lot of you. This is absolutely positive. Um, this is a sense that you are going to be finding yourself in the month of October. And coming out and recognizing where, which direction you need to go in. It's as if the illusions is now fading away and you're recognizing. Oh, I see a lot of you are going to be starting your own business or a lot of you are going to be going into working for yourself. A lot of you are going to be starting for yourself and this is going to be good. It's like a lot of people are thinking I'm so sick of uh, working in uh, Tinder and I'm going to start for myself. And it's going to be a yes because there's going to be so much opportunities and so much things uh, um, that you're going to be finding yourself in that is going to be available for a lot of you. I see a lot of you are having relationship problems and uh, a lot of you are worried about your relationship. A lot of you are worried about uh, it's as if some of you um, are worried about your child because your child could be in a relationship where you think that this child is not in, in the right healthy relationship. So a lot of you Aries women are worried about a relationship you're in. And it's uh, trying to figure out, you know, why am I so drawn to this person? And it is um, love magic. That is the reason why you are joined to this person. It's as if this person have um, have like a, a hook on you. And it is love magic. This person use love magic. And I see you constantly thinking about this person. So if you notice, you ladies, the falter in your, it's as if you're lovesick. And this does happen. So be aware of this. Um, it is not bad. It is good. But sometimes you need to find out why are you so drawn to this person? Is it for the right reasons? Because obviously you're drawn to this person and you are not understanding the reason why. And I see a lot of you need to step back, step back. 
step back okay um a leo and a scorpion try to get some sort of a new start so it could be um 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 some of you um and this is the leo is the lover okay and is a new person and they're so in love with you and wanted to get a new start but i see um this new start is not going to be coming in and i don't know why um this new start is it's like this is not supposed to happen okay you aries had took a whole lot of money from a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person that lives in another country, the money is going to be returned. I see they're going to be coming down on you because you, uh, Aries, uh, um, and I see um, the money, a Sagittarian is going to be saying, no, the money is for a Taurus, Virgo, or a Capricorn person. So it's as if you, Aries, had took money that was not yours, um, and it is another country. Um, it's like a business in another country and they're going to be saying, no, no, no. Um, the money is for a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. Okay. So be aware. I see a lot of you are going to be working. Um, it's not well, but you're going to be working with a Pisces person. This could be your child. Um, and this child is going to be helping you. They're now going to be recognizing that a Gemini person, um, from another country, uh, together with their family stole a lot of money um, and it is going to be coming out you Aries could be uh, um, recognizing what this person have done okay I do love you guys I gotta go I'm saying namaste until next time